What is going on, guys? Welcome back for another episode of Avoni, The King's Return. All right, so what we're going to do, guys, is what I looked at back on uh, all the videos I've made in the past, the past maybe a couple years I've been doing this, and there's a lot of games that I've made maybe a couple years ago that I've made one video, maybe two, and I just never follow back up with those games. So this is one of those. All right, so this is called Ebony, The King's Return. It's an SLG game, and what turned me off, I think, is like you guys probably like the game. You guys watched it and everything like that. The um, the videos, but I just never was into the whole portrait mode in these games. But I, I'm okay with it now. I gr I've grown to adapt to it, and it, it becomes pretty okay now. I can kind of accept it with a stride. All right, so this game is in portrait mode, but the graphics. Oh my god, the graphics are so amazing, guys. Like yes. So that's like we're, all we're doing right now, focusing this week is on games that we made a couple years ago. Now, the only games I've played that were maybe a couple years ago is like King of Babylon. That's like the oldest game I played. And I think last um, Shelter Survival. Those are the only games that I played for a couple years that are still on the channel. And that's okay. It's not a big deal. But this one right here, dang, I wish I would have stuck with this. This is a brand new account. I don't have my, like my, a lot of these games, I've, I've downloaded every one of those games and I've logged on. And I can barely find my um, my account. So most of my accounts are gone. So I don't have those accounts anymore. But I didn't make it very far anyway. So it wasn't that big of a deal, honestly. And it, it also puts you on a new server. So you don't want to start an older game and go on an old server. Because it doesn't make up make any sense. Because those guys that are on those servers are already maxed out. They're already doing their thing. And you're just going to be right behind on what they're doing right now. And that's pretty much it. But this game really has some really good graphics. I know a lot of people do play this game still. And I think you can probably play this on PC. I'm not 100% sure on that part, but I think you can. I don't know. So we're just going to go ahead and collect these little goals. Click, click, click. We did a lot. And we got we did a lot for just one talent point. That's weird. So we got one talent point just for doing all that stuff. Um, let's see. My liege. Welcome to Lands of Ebony. As a new player. A magical shield of beginner protection has been cast on your city, which prevents other players from being able to attack or scout you for a short period of time. This uh, use this time to develop your city and prepare for war. That's what I'm doing. Additionally, you now have received a beginner package gift for free to help you grow. You can find it uh, and use this gift in your items inventory. All right, so I did find it. It's pretty cool. Let's go check. And there it is. All right, so with this, it's going to have all these other things inside. It's got the, oh, I guess you can't click on it. I guess I'll just open it. All right, so we got 50 gems, 5-minute speed ups, 30 minutes VIP, uh, 5K lumber times 2, and growth package. Once we hit level 3, I think that is. Oh, we already did. So this is our level 3 one. This is nice. We get the uh, gems, speed up, stamina. 500 chips, growth package, and we open the next one. I think we can. Four gems, 10 minute speed up, 500 Monarch Arc XP, uh, 5k box, and growth package. So you can actually choose civilizations too on this. And I can't remember which one I picked. I think I picked the uh, USA, I think. Or I forgot. I'll look in a sec. Not really sure how to check that, but I think. Hmm. Maybe Korea? Now, you can't really update your... You can't download your own avatar, which is kind of a downer for me, I think. Like, I think they should give you the option to put your own photo for your avatar, which is, I think is pretty cool. They should do that. But with all that being said, this is pretty cool. It's got so many different features in it. You know, if you're an alliance, of course... You're definitely going to be um, taken well, uh, better taken care of if you have an alliance. If you don't have an alliance, you're still going to be okay. But I don't know. It's one of those things you just want to be in an alliance. Any kind of game like this, you want to be in an alliance. Or you're going to be sitting there struggling just a little bit. Struggling just a wee bit. All right. And that's pretty much the gist of that part. Got some alliance help. Go ahead and assist there. Um, 
it really does tell you a lot. Like as far as like research, okay, I gotta do research. You can go click on that on the little short things here with the little three dots. You can click on that. You can link your account. You can do all kinds of cool stuff like that. All right, so this alliance, they invite me to their location. I don't know if they're even um, active. I don't wanna move to an, an active, an inactive alliance territory. They may switch. All right, so another announcement that we have, the civiliz uh, Civilization Celebration event. Uh, dear Evonians, in order to thank you for your support and love from Evoni, we have a series of exciting events from April 29th to May 2nd. Join strategic stockpile events to get rewards from gem purchase. Uh, during the event, you will get many rewards by purchasing certain amount of basic gems every day. This event resets daily. Please claim your rewards in time. All right, so join Legion hunting event to get rewards. Legion hunting event is open and great rewards are awaiting you during the event. You can get many rewards when you complete quests every day. Uh, the event is resets every day. Please claim your rewards in time. We're, we already know that already. Uh, Silk Road events open during the event time. Complete quests and earn traded goods. Silk can be used to redeem rewards. <coughs> Consume resource to earn awesome rewards. There'll be a short-term consuming return event in which players can get awesome rewards from consuming a certain amount of gold and certain speed-ups. That's pretty cool. They're trying to take care of this um, population. Alright, so resource gathering reports. We got that from the farm. And that's what the base looks like on the inside. Now, let's look at the world on the outside. I don't think that we have... Oh, well, we got the... Well, it won't let me do anything. So when we occupy, I already occupied the uh, other one, but this is pretty cool. I mean, as far as like colors and everything like that, graphics, it's pretty cool. And I think it's pretty viable for 2019, to be honest with you guys. It's pretty cool. So 2019, this game definitely has some potential to be, you know, a really good game. So I don't know. <clears throat> I haven't made it that far, but yeah, I like it. But either way, guys, if you guys like this game, you want to see it on a rotation, Please put in the comments down below that you want to see this in a rotation of some sort. And we'll see if we can do that accommodate depending on what kind, how many votes we get. And But yeah, it's really it's really cool, guys, to sit back and play a game like this. Uh, but all, the, all that being said, guys, thanks so much for watching. See you on the next one. Be safe.